Hi, this is Justina from Practice Test Academy and in this short video I will give you a personal tour of our testing software. Below the information about the B1 paper you will find the heart of our software. Our tests are divided into two categories, study mode and an exam mode. You should use the study mode if you want to practice and learn at the same time. In a study mode, you will get the answer straight away, so you will understand if you were correct or not and why. You should use the exam mode, which is actually an exam simulator, if you want to test your knowledge under the exam conditions. That means you will have a limited time to complete the questions and you will get the score and the feedback for each question after you complete the test. Now let me walk you through an example of a study mode. You have two possibilities here. You can either practice all your questions from the particular part just by clicking this button here or here at the bottom. Or you can practice each subpart separately just by clicking those links here. That is convenient if you want to polish your knowledge from the particular topic. We have written our questions based on the Kaplan study book, so in most cases the subparts will correspond to the names of the Kaplan chapters. Let me show you the inside of the tool. Doesn't it look similar to the Pearson view, right? Ok, let me start with the buttons here at the, at the end. You can always skip a question if you don't know the answer. You can go to the previous one, to the next one, you can end your exam here as well. Now let's look at the question. This is a typical multiple choice type of question. If you provide the correct answer, you're going to see the green screen here. If you provide an incorrect answer, that, that's going to be red. Explanation will be exactly the same, so you know why you were wrong. For example, this is a typical fill in the blank type of question. Here you need to input the correct value. If you input the incorrect value, you're going to see red screen here explaining what actually should be input and why the calculation looks like it looks. Just to show you another example, this is a typical drop down type, type of question. Here you just need to select the correct answer and click on the next button. We have included here all the possible question types that SEMA utilizes in their exams. Additionally, we have added here the tables and the equations, so you can have a look at them in case you forgot something. Also, this is exactly how it looks on your real exam. Now, let's move on to the mock exams. We give you three different types of mock exams. One full mock with 60 unique questions, which means that they are original and cannot be found in any of the above parts here. We also give you two other types of mocks, a full mock with 60 non-unique questions and another one mini mock with 30 questions. The functionality of mock is exactly the same, however we utilize SEMA methodology here and we randomly pick questions from our database, which means that it is almost impossible to have two mocks that have the same types of questions. As you can see, the number of the questions within the mock are selected based on the percentage syllable split. So, in our case, if part A covers 25% of the syllabus, you can expect to receive 15 questions. Additional features to mention is that you can practice your time management and also improve your exam technique by utilizing features like flag for review or show results spanner, where here you can clearly see the questions that you have attempted, the questions that are still incomplete and the questions that you have flagged. One of our biggest competitive advantages is that you can clearly see how well you've done within each part and within each subpart. If you would like to review the questions, the correct answers and the answers you have provided, you can click this button here. You can also take this quiz again. And if you'd like to compare the results of this test with the results of the test you have done previously, you can always do that by going to results. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you got the same impression as all of our other students 
that this is exactly what you need to pass your upcoming BA2 exam. Remember, we also provide a tutor monitored Facebook group and a 7 day money back guarantee. So in case you are still unsure, just keep in mind that we transfer the risk on us so you don't need to worry. Thanks again and goodbye.